Okay. Hey, Libra. Okay, Libra, what are the messages for Libra? We have the Queen of Wands. This is in your recent past or currently. Right now we have the Queen of Wands. Somebody doesn't want to, somebody does not want to take action. They don't want to move forward in a forward in a relationship because they don't really have there's no attraction. Somebody's really not attracted to Libra, or you are or vice versa. You're not you're not attracted. It can go either way. Somebody's not taking movement to um, to move forward. This is leaving you you feeling stuck. The current situation is you feeling a little bit um, bored, stuck, not happy with what you have currently, what your choices or what you have in your life right now. Really wanting some something else um, and not really seeing anything available at this point. You guys might want some kind of, you might have made some poor decisions in the past, or you may not be giving somebody a second chance. You may, you may not, somebody may not be giving you a second chance because we have the um, judgment in reverse. You're not getting a second chance or a chance. Somebody's not giving you a chance. There is some kind of an apology here on the table. Somebody, the other person wants to apologize. The other person sees that there was, um, they're feeling bad about the way that they spoke to you. Um, this is somebody that you stopped talking to. There was maybe no, no, no second chance within that situation with that person. They didn't give you a second chance. So they may be feeling guilty about that. Maybe they made a bad decision. And now maybe they're sorry for it. Again, this can go either way, you guys. So just remember that um, sometimes it can be turned around. So just keep that in mind. Um, the apology could be coming in from them. And you may, again, you may not be giving them a second chance. So you may not be accepting the apology. Also, I see that you, you're having a hard time focusing on starting a new relationship, a new beginning. You don't want to. Again, it's, it's like you're not giving a second chance. You don't, want to, you, don't want to, you don't want to offer a relationship. You don't want to focus on it. You don't want to start one at all. And we have this other person that really does. They're offering love to you. They're offering their heart, their, their feelings to you. They're opening up to you and they're talking to you and um, they're hoping for uh, to start something new with you, but you're just not interested. It's like you want something else. You're not interested in this person. You want some, you want this, you want something, you want, you want to, you might want somebody else, this other person over here. Maybe you're not attracted to this person. Libra in love. Libra. Yeah, you're a little, you're a little bit uh, sensitive right now. You don't want to, you're not feeling that friendly. And the other person, um, because of that, now the other person may be having a hard time as well. Um, it's, it's almost like both of you. Now you're both, now you're both not wanting to start a relationship. <laughs> yeah, you've become, the other person now is, is, is very unsatisfied. They're not happy. And they now, they're now telling you they don't want to have a relationship. They're, they opened up to you saying they were sorry and that they, they, they were offering you friendship or, uh, you know, some form of um, being open and offering you communication. And then that led to all of a sudden now 
<laughs> they don't want to, they, they, now they've changed their mind. Maybe they don't now want to, um, focus on this new relationship because you've been so negative toward, you've been so, um, clear you've been clear to them in the way that you're feeling or they see that you're obviously not interested um you're definitely 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 100 percent uh holding your holding your building a wall holding yourself very safe you don't want to say anything to this person um they're telling you they're not satisfied they're unhappy and you are absolutely not going to open up you're not going to Give them anything. You're not going to give them anything. Libra. Libra. You know, Libra, you have a lot of options around you. You have a lot of options around you. There's a lot, of, um, a lot to choose from. You might be a little bit um, confused right now about what it is, who you want, or you know what it, what it is that you want. Um, the other, there's somebody around you that wants a commitment. They, they may already be committed. And the person, this other person, again, it's almost like um, you have a lot to choose from, and now you're really confused about what it is that you want. And now you've, uh, it, it's the last, the last week here, it just seems like you lost hope uh, over something. I guess you've uh, you're having a hard time. Um, you're having a hard time here. Let me see. You're having a hard time um, seeing why you should even attempt to do anything when it's not, you're just you're starting to feel a little bit negative. But the outcome here somewhat is there something's changing and a new door is opening. A new door is going to be opening for you. So even though you may be feeling right now, uh, I'm, I'm, maybe you're just not, you're not, uh, you're not, you're not seeking a relationship or you're not, um, you're taking a break because you really just don't think anything's going to work out. But I see that you, the, the energy coming into you is good luck. Things are going to start turning in your favor. There's going to be some forward movement and some, a, a door opening for you. Libra, Libra love, Libra and love. Libra in love. The fool. So this is the most likely outcome for you, Libra. You are going to be on a new journey. You're going to be going by yourself. So you're going to be uh, taking chances. You're going to leave behind um, things that no longer serve you. You're going to start a new journey by yourself. You're going to see what, what comes up, what comes up for you see what comes in your comes to you yep and what else do we have in your near future this is what's coming in for you is the knight of wands so in the near future when you start this new journey by yourself um you're going to run into passion you're going to find passion again and you're going to go for it or passion's coming into you. Either way, it's here. It's coming in the near future. Absolutely. And this fell out of the deck. This fell out of the deck. Ace of Cups. This is love. This is love coming towards you. Love being handed to you. Um, beautiful, fulfilling, satisfying love. That's in your near future. So 
So by the end of this month, you guys, it is unbelievable what's going to start happening. New doors are going to start opening for you. And this is where it's going to lead. It's Everything's going to start going in your favor. Turning around. Wow, these cards are... Wow, and we have the sun. This is how you see it. You're going to be very happy. This is how you see, see your future. So your future is going to be amazing coming up. It just looks like by the end of this month, it's going to take a while to get through some of this. Um, these energies here that are not really happening that you really need to, obviously, uh, it's part of your process. So yeah, let's go ahead and pull a couple of these cards here. What's the final message for Libra and love? Libra and love. By the end of this month, you guys, you're on your way to new things. Happiness, love, passion. Seeing clearly. This is the card you have. Oops. Okay. It's time to view things from a different perspective. You have the blessing, blessed gift to see past through I'm sorry, past the current situation and envision an amazing, amazing possibilities. Don't worry. The pause in the moment while you rethink your plan won't last. Embrace your uniqueness and allow, to, allow it to serve you. So yeah, guys, get ready on your new journey. It's going to be alone in the beginning. It's going to lead you to amazing love because... It's coming in your favor. New doors are going to start to open. The next, what is the next card we have for Libra and love? You're going to see once this happens, you guys are going to, you're going to be like so happy because you're going to be like, wow. You're going to be seeing things in a beautiful new way. Okay. Receptivity. Allow yourself to receive. This will increase your intuition, energy, and ability to give to others. You guys, so don't let this, uh, anything that's around you, do not let it um, make you, do not continue to hold on so dearly and tight <clears throat> to your emotions, to what you value um, out of fear, out of um, fear, you know, by fear of losing it. You don't want to hold on too tight. So it's just saying right here, be open. So once you get through all this stuff, you guys will be fine. You just, you'll be open again to love because it is, it's on its way. It's telling me right here. Um, I'm really curious to see how your February goes because obviously something really great is coming in for you. You guys have love, love, love. 